Could, could I take yeah. a, a stab at clarifying a potential uh -huh. legal issue? Uh -huh. um, the, the problem with considering things under council communications is you can't legally take a consensus action right. because it hasn't been there there hasn't been a description on the agenda and the public don't know what your um, you may or may not bring up and it may be something um, very appropriately to be considered for future future action but the problem is under that part of your agenda currently, you can't really seek a vote of a majority of council to then direct the city manager to place it on the agenda. So the purpose of this formalized rule is to actually give an opportunity to do that and get the public invited in the discussion because if you submit it ahead of time, which um, we're supposed to do anyway with, within the week, if you submit the item ahead of time, it can be placed on the agenda under this new section with a sufficient description. There won't be a staff report yet, so staff resources will not have been expended. However, there can be sufficient description in the title that the public understands what, um, what will be considered and you can all talk about it and even take an action that evening under that section without a staff report. You, or the, there could be no action taken. Or the action could be, gee, we would actually like a formal staff report and more information about this item. Please schedule it for a future meeting. So any of those things could happen, but the real purpose is to uh, a permit a legal action to be taken and public participation. You can do that if you formalize it under this new section. Does, does that make sense?